Welcome to Jesus Calling for December 4th. My thoughts are not your thoughts. Let's look at Isaiah 55 verses 8 to 9 and Colossians 4 verse 2. I love Isaiah 55 verse 8 and 9. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts higher than your thoughts. Colossians 4 verse 2 says, Devote yourselves to prayer, being watchful and thankful. And pray for us too, that God may open a door for our message, so that we may proclaim the mystery of Christ, for which I am in chains. My thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are my ways your ways. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways and thoughts higher than yours. Remember who I am when you spend time with me. Marvel at the wonder of being able to commune with the king of the universe. That's pretty cool, isn't it? At any time and any place. Never take this amazing privilege for granted. Though I am vastly higher and greater than you, I am training you to think my thoughts. As you spend time in my presence, my thoughts gradually form in your mind. My spirit is the director of this process. Sometimes he brings a Bible verse to mind. Sometimes he enables you to hear me speak directly to you. These communications strengthen you and prepare you for whatever is before you on your life path. Take time to listen to my voice. Through your sacrifice of precious time, I will bless you far more than you dare to ask. And that is so true, my friends. The more time you spend in His Word and the more time you spend praying and even singing and reading devotions and being in Bible study with other friends and going to church and listening to praise music and all of those things, the more you do that, the more His Spirit is going to work in you. And I know that's true. There's been times where I'm not sure maybe what to do in a situation and a Bible verse will come to mind or something that a pastor has said or a podcast I've listened to. If you want to have a productive day, start with the Word of God and just be open to all the things He's going to bring to you all day long. I hope you have a great day hearing from God and the Holy Spirit, and I will see you back here tomorrow. You can order your own Jesus Calling devotional book by going to JesusCalling.com. And I would love to answer any questions you may have about faith in Jesus. Just email me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com. And I hope you go out and shine for Him today. See you tomorrow.